All right, so we're going to be going into some Crucible with the Red Death, and this is the only exotic where I have both ornaments for the actual weapon. And uh, these are White Witch, which is probably my least favorite out of the two, and Steel Witch. And I actually like this one just because it's so simple and with the whole all spike theme. I don't know, it, I just personally like it. And I'm actually really curious to see how the Red Death will do in Crucible, because in year one, this was like a really dominant weapon. But nowadays, I don't think it's very good just because of the whole meta and like how high impact, uh, low fire rate, Pulses aren't the best in Crucible, but this weapon, I think at longer ranges, can still hold up. So we are going to go into some Crucible and see how we can do with this weapon. Alright, so we're going to start off with the Steel Witch Ornament first, and switch uh, after this game. So this map should be pretty good for this weapon. All I want is kind of a longer range map, because I don't want to get like shotgun or like rush and stuff. Especially while using this weapon. Oh, he's already low. All right, there's one. Oh, there's two. If you hit headshots with this thing with high cal, it's so good. Oh, that's a last word. Oh, that's a last word. Like this gun can be deadly, but not nearly as good as it was in your one. Oh, oh, the headshots are so crispy. Oh my goodness. Oh, just hit headshots with this thing, and oh, it's so nice. I never actually realized this during the video, but when you get into a 1v1 gunfight and kill the other person and they leave you absolute, Red Death Perk actually gives you full health regeneration instantly, which is something I never mentioned and what makes this gun really good, on top of the fact that it has high cal and like two burst abilities. <gasps> wait, wait, that wasn't double kill? Oh, we got melee from behind though. Alright, we're gonna three tap him. Oh, that's a blade. Oh! A headshot? What I don't understand with blade is sometimes you can one shot it with a shotgun, and 60% of the time it does really pretty much nothing. Oh, don't blend or else. Oh! <gasps> what was that? Oh my good, we just destroyed him. Oh no, skip nades. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, we're dead. Oh. There's a three tap. You see, this thing is actually really good, but at just close range, it just doesn't perform very well. Oh no, not again. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, we don't need heavy. Oh. Yo, he just encouched me. He just encouched me. What? Sir, get off me. Look at them over there. Look at them over there. Oh, here they come. Oh, get trick shotted. Oh my goodness. There's like a ton of them there. Oh, he just. How did he headshot me? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Rip him. Oh, there's Tevil. Okay, let's let's get out of there. We don't want the shotgun anymore. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we okay, we just completely flanked him. All right, let's pop that there. Anybody want to push us? Oh, no. Enemy captured zone B. Oh, we're gonna warrior him. We're gonna warrior him. All right, so there's the first game. Now we're gonna go to the second game and change the ornaments, so you guys can see how the other ornament looks. I mean, it doesn't change the weapon, but it it just I guess it just looks different. All right, so we got Pantheon for the second map, and honestly, I couldn't have chosen a better map for this weapon. So I like the the maps we're we're playing on. Good choices. Okay, so this is the White Witch Ornament, and uh, yeah, this one's also really cool. I just personally like the other one, just because it's a bit simpler, I guess. I don't know. You're falling behind. See, the thing is, I can't get sniped. Oh, he just... Oh, there we go, okay. I was going to say, he just jacked both the kills from me. 
Okay, so there's smoke and water. Or fire and water. So, what? How is that even logical? Oh, we just... Oh, okay, we traded. Was... Oh, no. Please, please. Oh, he missed. Okay, there's a kill. I keep getting cleanups. Which isn't the greatest. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, nope. Okay. See? Scout rifles. Scout rifles. Ah, those things destroy. That's a blade. Oh. Oh. Hello? Hello? Yo, blade it? <laughs> Get destroyed. The amount of aim assist that blade has is honestly what keeps it from being not... Like, it keeps it from being like the worst super in the game. Because honestly, blade isn't the greatest. And if it didn't have that like extreme auto aim, it would be pretty bad. Dude, he just destroyed that guy. Uh oh, I heard a hammer. Oh, that's my team. Yo, okay. Oh! <laughs> the trade with the rocket! Uh, they know him. Oh. Oh, he tried rushing, rip. Oh no! Oh, blind perdition, man. These, these legendaries, man. These legendaries. I don't know if you guys saw my Hawkman video, but I was also complaining about legendaries. Just legendaries are so OP right now. It's just, it's crazy. Like, exotics aren't even exotics at this point. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no, no, uh-uh, uh-uh. Oh, ha! <laughs> he just tethered the wall. Oh, no. Come on, teammate. Oh. Was he, was he high-fiving me or something? What? Oh. Oh, he just choked. Oh, my goodness. That would have been so bad. Okay, we won. We won. All right. So, uh, there you guys have it. That's, that's pretty much the ornaments for you. So yeah, honestly, the, the ornaments do make the guns look better. So if you guys want to use them and you do have them, I mean, I, I think over it. There's no point in not using them. All right, so there you guys have it. That was the White Witch and the Steel Witch ornaments for the Red Death. So if you guys did enjoy, go and leave a like on the video and uh, comment if you guys want me to use any other weapon or anything like that. But thank you for the support recently because honestly, like, I've gotten so many messages and friend requests from people. Like, it's honestly ridiculous. So you guys are awesome. So thank you guys, like, for all the work recently and... Uh, did I just say great work recently? Okay, well, I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys for like the support recently, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later.